on to next week. How much are well, you looking forward to next week now? I am. I'm looking forward to getting there. I haven't been there in geez, 17 years. Yeah. So, uh, uh, from what I've heard, what the, the guys have said, it's uh, be a little scoring again next week. And uh, you can check it out. Tiger, what are you going to miss the most about playing at Akron in this course? Well, I think not just the golf course, but just the community. You know, this has been uh, just a fantastic event for all these years. Uh, I've been coming here for over 20 years, and I uh, see the same people, you know, following on, and you actually see them on some type of the same hole, you know, and we're going to miss that. And this is one of the classic golf courses that, um, unfortunately, we don't get a chance to play very often. Any irony on the pin placement on 18 shot in the Yeah, how about that, huh? <laughs> you know, uh, I've made a few birdies there, and uh, it, was, it was a good way to end it at least for another eight more years. Like, was there anything today you could take on the next week? Well, today I was just trying to just be as aggressive as possible and fire everything. And it was either going to be 62 or 63 or something in the mid-70s. <laughs> um, I was just going to be aggressive and see what happens. I was so far back that it was just one of those, I had to play a great round just to try and get in the top 10. And uh, sometimes it works out, sometimes it doesn't. What did, um, what, what was missing this week compared to two weeks ago when you know, you were right there on Sunday. Well, I did hit the ball as clean as I wanted to, and uh, I only putted well the first day. Uh, I struggled hitting the putts hard enough this week. It, it felt, looked faster than they were putting for me, and uh, I just struggled making that adjustment. Is this the first time all year, you think, where you really were not, you know, you came to the event without having practiced much? Um, you know, every, every tournament you played, it seemed that you spent at least some time the week prior working on your game. Do you think that is any any issue at all? No, I, I, uh, I didn't hit as many balls as I, as I normally would going into an event, but uh, I needed a break. I, I pushed it hard through the open. And, uh, I needed a break because uh, this stretch coming up here is going to be a big stretch starting this week and you know, through the playoffs. Those thank you, Tiger Chance. That seem almost premature. Oh, man. <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna miss this place. You know, I'm gonna miss playing here. I'm gonna miss the people. And, uh, I've had so many great memories, and it's just it's sad that we're not coming back here anymore. Uh, I've, I've always enjoyed playing here. I love playing here, even when it's a whole series of golf. You know, and, uh, now it's become a bigger event, but you know, uh, unfortunately, we, we, we have to move on and guys that I plan against are going to be playing here next year, so uh, you know, we'll see how they play. Why <laughs> just left said that you have the cutthroat competitiveness inside the ropes that you grew up watching, but it's changed, you're able to leave that inside the ropes now. Do you agree with that? Are you somehow different than you were 10 or 20 years ago in that respect? Well, I, I think it's a lot has changed since kids. I'd play a bad round, I'd you know, fester a little bit, but now I'd, you know, I'd go home and I'd be with the kids or they want to talk and FaceTime and that changes, that, that evolves, that's, that's life. And, and put things in, into perspective. You know, remember at the rally, you guys asked me when I three putt last hole, you know, how, how did it feel? And I, when I saw Sam, I don't, I don't remember ever missing a putt. You know, so that that's just life and it, it changes. and then, Time to play, it's time to play, and then when it's not, it's, um, it's, just, it's just different. Your ball to the, today, was your left, was it just cut, or your body, or what was the problem? Yeah, I, I hit a few balls this week, and uh, also hit a few blocks, and so I had a ball to go on today, uh, this week. And I didn't quite hit the balls as clean as I wanted to, or, or I wasn't a sharp man, for sure. And um, the first day, you know, making a bunch of putts helped uh, kind of cover a few things up. Uh, but I, I need to clean things up come Thursday, and I, I got three more days to work on it. Do you intend that going for 16, no matter what the season? Uh, no, I only had 238 front. Um, so it's just a I had just a terrible ball shot. I tried to get a forearm you know, up in the air, and then try to hit it up, I thinned it. And, but Given how that was the approach going into the day, is I'm going to try 16. No, I depends on. I thought the tee shot was in the fairway. And I hit up the right side, 
you know, it was borderline where there's going to be in a rough run off the right and end up in the first cut on the left. But I had a chance. I mean, it was a simple shot, and I hit a bad shot. Tiger, Last given how guys. consistently well you've been playing, did it come as a surprise at all your struggles this week? Say again? Given how consistently well you've been playing, did your struggles this week come as a surprise at all? Nah, it happens, you know. And, uh, I didn't really play well at the US Open. That was like, two tournaments ago. So, it, it, it is, uh, three tournaments ago. It, it is what it is.